Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lisa, if this is your very first time here. In today's video, I'm reviewing another skin tint. Yes, we're still on a hunt. I am still testing and reviewing, trying all these skin tints and trying to find the best skin tint overall period for deep skin. And so in today's video, we're trying the new Hourglass Veal Hydrating Skin Tint foundation which is available in a whopping 18 shades it retails for 49 dollars and not only can you find it on hourglasscosmetics.com i think that's the website but you can also find it at sephora as well it does come in a 1.1 floral ounce um and the shade that i got was an 18. now i am going to provide you with more details but without any further ado let's go ahead and get into this review <laughs> I did get a chance to swatch it in Sephora. I wasn't gonna get it. Somebody mentioned it, asked me if I was gonna be trying it. I just happened to be in Sephora returning something that day. Look up, boom, hourglass. So I figured I might as well go ahead and give it a try. And as it pertains to deep skin tones, it does have ranges in the medium deep. Um, and it goes from like a medium deep to all the way the number 18 deep neutral. As a matter of fact, it begins with medium with neutral just kidding it begins with medium deep with warm undertones and then it goes to medium deep with neutral undertones oh does it have a two let me tell you what i find interesting because when it goes to deep skin tones there's only one neutral in the deep skin tones which is why i was stuck with the 18 but in the medium deep there are like four different neutral options isn't that suspicious it's very suspicious and so i was ultimately stuck with going with the 18 so we're gonna go ahead and um try this this is the packaging um and it's that you're getting let's go ahead and take it out here of course it is covered right here but i am gonna try to find something to pin my hair back i think this is as best as i'm gonna be able to pin my hair back i've already primed my face today i use the bobby brown vitamin enriched face based moisturizing primer i only had a little bit of this and so i use this around my face whatever I had left I still haven't shopped this Nordstrom sale because they have a dual pack I need to stop playing and go and shop it and then the elf power grip primer I use that in my t-zones let's go ahead and let's put this on my wrist so this is what it looks like on my wrist and to me on my wrist it looks a little dark okay so I'm applying it I thought the camera was rolling originally but here it is on my skin tone and it is absolutely giving perfect match um you can see the hydration and i don't know to me the coverage is looking pretty good you may hear <laughs> i'm just gonna go ahead and finish off the rest of my face because i have somebody doing the lawn and so I know y'all hear that out there I'm gonna go ahead and finish off the rest of my face I might even oh gosh because I don't want these people looking straight in my face I, I hope this looks good but um <laughs> listen I want to get I'm gonna get this out but this is how it looks I'm um, since now all of a sudden they want to do the backyard i'm gonna go ahead and finish off the rest of my face come back with the finished look and you guys can let me know your thoughts okay Okay, 
so this is it this is the finished look i usually have my window up but i'm gonna and i'm gonna go ahead and bring up that window so it's gonna change just a little bit and i love to record by this window because i feel like it gives you more of like a realistic look of what it's going to look like in the natural light. I just have a thing for natural light. So I'm going to go ahead and fix my hair. I'm going to run out, do a few errands. And I like it. Oh my gosh. You talk about coverage. It's giving lightweight natural foundation. Um, the coverage I feel like is absolutely beautiful. It is there. Honey, sis is giving. I'm feeling all of the 52%. Definitely all of the 52%. I think I'm slowly becoming a skin tint girl. I don't know. I really, really like this foundation. Now let's see how it holds up because it is supposed to also be long wearing. I definitely think that it's worth all of the $49 <laughs> that she costs, but absolutely beautiful. I'm loving the finish. I'm gonna make sure I come back. It ain't gonna be nighttime all late, me struggling as bloodshot when I come back, but we gonna come back. So I'm back. With the wear test, I think I finished around like noon. I didn't even really mean for it to last this long, but it did because the time is now 7.03 p.m. And um, so we're here. <laughs> and uh, to me, in my personal opinion, the foundation is still, the skin tint, in fact, is still giving. Lightweight, breathable, felt like I had absolutely nothing on my face but my skin was absolutely beautiful. I'm not even gonna lie, like every time I looked in the mirror, I walked into Sephora earlier today and one of the girls gave me a compliment, like, oh my gosh, your makeup looks so pretty. Um, but um, I really, really, really like her. Highly recommended, definitely worth the money, worth the hype. Um, of course, I creased in the places that I expected for me to crease um, I didn't even have like a whole lot of creasing like here and I don't know if that's because of the setting powder that I use today but I don't know she's giving she is very much so giving I don't know I think this might outdo my Danessa Myricks it might replace my Janessa Myricks. Um, I mean, I, I, I don't know. I don't even really know what I expected by a brand or a product that was backed by like statistical, statistical numbers. Like, I guess I kind of sort of expected for it to be good. But um, that is it for this video. Let me know what you think. Very much so hydrating, breathable, long wearing because this is seven hours later and she did the damn thing. But that is it for this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It does help for this video to become a little bit more discoverable out here in these YouTube streets. Um, also, as I always like to say, if we vibe, subscribe. Join the tribe, join the community, and make sure that you never miss a beat. And until the next video, 